Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, on our last project, I enjoyed making this Sakura branch very much and I have to make a part 2 of our great branch project. So today, we'll be making this. So I hope you stick around and keep on watching. So, before we start, remember to let the grape branch dry out for a few days. Then, coat it with glue or Mod Podge to preserve and add strength to the branch. When the branches are fully dried, we can now select the perfect stone for our project. Choose the grape branch that would fit perfectly on the stone. Today, I'll use this small maple leaf puncher. I'll use the beacon adhesive to attach the branch to the stone and the platform cart outdoor sealer to finalize our project surface. We'll punch out maple leaves by using paper stock and I'll use fall colors for this one. Let's start by putting a message on the stone. Since the surface is not even, I'll sketch it out first. And for our quick tip of the day, remember that in calligraphy, upward strokes are commonly thin. And downward strokes are thicker. And here, I'm using a microtip calligraphy pen I got from Daiso. Now that that's done, we can now punch out paper maple leaves. Let's attach the branch by using the Magnetic Adhesive. It dries out quickly as it is alcohol based.
once it dries, we'll apply Elmer's glue on the tips of the branch and attach the paper leaves one by one. I'll put in two green leaves to symbolize hope. We can now finalize the surface of the project with the plaid folk art outdoor sealer. And there you have it, your very own stone tree of hope. You can use this as decoration or paperweight and it also makes a nice gift to your friends and family. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more My Art Life videos. I'll see you again on our next project.